I'm not in the mood to film at all. It's raining. This is a whole struggle, but I am here to film for you. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you guys can see in the title and the main photo, I am finally doing a swimsuit haul. I have been like addicted this summer to buying swimwear. I'm not normally like a huge swimwear junkie um, just because I'm not a big fan of the beach. I don't really care to go to the beach. Like it's cool for like a couple hours, but I am just not a beach person. I don't really care to be at the pools or anything like that, but after you know, last year and lockdown and all that, I told myself this summer I am going to be by the pool, at the beach, I am not turning down any invitations anymore. So I just got super inspired to buy a ton of swimwear. After buying all the stuff that I bought here, I ended up purchasing two more bathing suits. Um, so I'll probably show those to you guys in like a vlog or something. I don't wanna wait for them because one is coming from, one is like on its way from New York and the other one is from like I don't even know where the other one is from, honestly. But I just don't feel like waiting. I wanted to film this. I don't know when those other swimsuits are going to get here. And I didn't want to keep putting it off. So I kind of have a mixture of high-end, uh, mid-range, and then low-end. I have from all different places. Brands that I'd never heard of. Um, really popular brands. Brands that I've just discovered. I am not going to be doing try-ons. But if I do have photos while I'm talking about the specific bathing suit, I will insert like a photo of the bathing suit whenever I did try it on. I think I have try-ons of all of these. Um, I'm just not gonna actually physically try it on because I'm gonna be super honest, I'm not in the mood to. So before we get started, in case I get asked, these lashes are the Kiss Number 11 lashes. I'm wearing an oversized uh, linen button-up from BNC, and that's basically it. So if you guys wanna see all of the bathing suits that I have been spending my money on, let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna start with the bathing suits that I've kind of already shown you guys. Um, I wanted to include them in here because I wanted to do just like an overall swimsuit haul. So the first one I'm going to start with, I actually wore this one in Mexico, so I do have a photo and I'll put it right in here um, as I'm talking about it, is this floral print one right here. I am in love with it because my favorite color is blue, so anything blue, it doesn't matter what it is, I am all into. This one is actually from Abercrombie and you can see the print right here. It's like this really cute floral print, which of course florals in the spring are like all the rage. Um, I bought this one a while ago, but if it is still available, I will link it down below. I got it in a size medium and it fits very true to size. I am a size medium in all swim all around. Unless I'm getting from like Shein, which I don't I don't shop on Shein, but um, everything else is a size medium, like literally everything. So it's these really cute uh, tie sides. I prefer that for my bathing suits. I have a couple here that aren't, but I personally prefer the ties because I have really really wide hips um, and a lot of the times like that's where I carry my weight is like on my sides and on my hips so sometimes these are way too tight and they like dig into my skin if they're not ones that I can like untie and retie so this is my personal favorite it's a nice high leg so it's really flattering on my body type and then the top has this underwire which I've never really purchased any bathing suits like that before but I loved that it kind of looked retro in a way like this reminded me of like bathing suits that my mom used to wear so i got a medium in the top and the medium medium in the bottom and this is from abercrombie next up i have this swimsuit here that i bought from a random uh site that i saw being sponsored on instagram it just popped up in my sponsored posts and with swimwear i don't know what it's been lately but every single sponsored post that i've seen i have purchased every single one a lot of these bathing suits are because of sponsored posts. But this one is from a new brand that I just discovered called New Era Swim. It's actually really cool because since I purchased this one, I went back and purchased another one. It's not here yet, but they just released, I think, two new colors. And one of them is like this beautiful turquoise blue. So as soon as they launched it, I wanted it. And I got this exact same cut. So I got this top here. I'm not, I can't remember what the name of this bathing suit is, but this is the top here. And what's really cool about this is that the owner of this company is actually an artist, like she paints, and all of these bathing, like this print is one of her paintings, which I thought was so cool and just like super unique. So it has two cans on it, it has avocados, palm leaves, it's just so pretty. So I got this top and then I also got the bottom to go with it. They do have like a thong style cheeky, but I just wanted this 
sort of cut it is cheeky but it's not a thong like it goes kind of like up your butt but not completely this is what the top and bottom look like very comfortable i got a size medium in this as well in both top and bottom it fits amazing and i just love it i've already worn this and yeah i really 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 like it i really like their brand as well next up i have one that i have not worn yet that i almost i kind of had like an issue with it so it is from a brand called summerfield swim this is what the branding looks like and i got a freaking pop-up thing on my sponsored post and i checked out their website and i saw this bathing suit and what caught me was the color if you guys can see it is like this vibrant poppy red color i think the color of it like the name of it is poppy and i don't own i don't wear red like it's just not my favorite color i never ever gravitate towards it but i just thought this would be so pretty on like nice tan skin so i got this bathing suit here it is a set this is the top. The top fits me fine, like if it, it fits really well actually. And then I got the matching bottoms and I ended up having to go back and purchase the size large of the bottoms because these don't have, like you can kind of see here, they don't tie here. And again, I have a very, I have very, very wide hips. So if something here fits me too tight, I literally get like this big roll of muffin top. It is not cute. And it is literally like, what i'm the most like self-conscious about body wise like my where i carry my weight is like in my hips and if i wear something that's too tight there it's like this huge like roll there and i hate it so i love the bathing suit so much that i ended up going back and getting a size large this one is actually the medium the large i didn't realize that i grabbed the medium on accident um the large fits me way 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 better i don't know what i'm gonna do with this one i'll probably see if i can sell it or something but this is what it looks like. I actually love the cut. Like, I love the cut so much. It's a cheeky bottom. This is the back. Love the bathing suit so much. It's just the bottom fit me. It just wasn't very flattering in the medium on my body type. It fit me. It just didn't fit me flattering. So, yeah, I ended up going back and getting the size large. Um, so now I have the medium and the large. But realistically, I'm never going to wear the medium. So I'm going to end up, like, selling it or giving it away or something. But, yeah, I got this bathing suit. The color is absolutely beautiful. I just had a little issue with the bottom. Then I purchased this bathing suit, and I love this. This one is from a brand called Wanderlust Swim. We got it from another ad, and what caught me was this color. This is the most stunning. It's coming off a little bit more pink on camera, but it's, it has a little bit more purple, um, and it has these elastic like a, a little elastic bungee strap so it's a one shoulder sort of bathing suit it's a high cut on the leg which for me is what i look for it is a cheeky back and not a thong but it is cheeky um and i wanted this in case i was doing something like with my family or just like somewhere that i didn't want to be wearing a two-piece like if i was with around like a ton of kids or let's say i was like at a barbecue with a lot of people and i didn't want to wear a one piece i wanted something really cute um in a really pretty color and the way that this looks against the tan is just so nice um, it fits really well. I love the fabric of it. Um, nice and compressing and just really, really nice. I really, really like this one a lot. Next up, I have my gooseberry bathing suits and I am addicted. If you want the best, most flattering one piece you will ever wear in your life, I could not recommend these gooseberry ones enough. Yes, they are a little bit more pricey. Well, they're a lot more pricey. They're $98. Um, unless you get them like during a sale which I actually got the green one during a sale But the first one that I purchased was this one here and it's like a grayish brown As soon as I tried this one on I was like I need every single color Like I am stopping myself from buying every single color in this one piece because I've never Worn a one piece more flattering than this the way that the waist Literally cinches in and it's a high cut so it doesn't cut off at like an awkward area on your hips I just love it. It's so flattering. It's definitely more of like a cheeky fit. If you can see, that's the back. Again, not a thong. It's just cheeky, but it's amazing. And I have the grayish brown color. I ended up buying the orange one when I went to Mexico with Tyler. And you can, you can just see right there, the way that this flatters your body is incredible. And then I ended up buying the green one, which I actually wore the other day. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw me post it, but just so cute i want the blue the white i want the black i honestly honestly want them all but i have a lot of bathing suits here to talk about so i was like you need to slow down lastly i want to talk about some swim that i got from meshki which i was actually waiting on this package to get here so that i could show you guys all of these bathing suits and i'm gonna be very honest i am very very disappointed in the quality i am 
like I I am not like better than or above buying like bathing suits from Target, Forever 21, H&M. Like I have tons of bathing suits from all those places. I don't really care. Like it's, it's just a bathing suit. But these are like paper thin. Like I was honestly shocked because you know, these weren't super expensive, but they weren't super cheap either. I think I paid $160 for four bathing suits, which again, it's not super expensive, but it's not super cheap either. I love the colors that I got. The colors are absolutely beautiful, but the material is so thin, like so much thinner than I could have imagined. And I'm not someone, I don't like padding in my tops. Like I take out the padding in all of my tops. Um, but yeah, I just was very, very, very disappointed in the quality. I'm still going to wear them, obviously. Like, it's not that big of a deal to where I would return them. I'm, I can't be bothered usually. Like, I'm not a big stickler for stuff like that. But yeah, just a heads up if you end up purchasing any of these. They are thin, like super thin. So I ended up getting this two-piece here that is like a lemon yellow. It's like such a, like, it's, it's like a pale highlighter yellow. So you can see here, I wanted something yellow to wear with a beautiful tan. So I got the top and the bottom. This is a size medium in both. Fits me true to size, fits perfect. It's just, again, very, very thin. I also purchased it in this baby pink, like this really cute, like Pepto-Bismol, like bubblegum sort of pink. And it's super cute. Like, love the color so much. Again, just like thin. Like, I'm not sure if you guys can tell. You probably can't tell through camera, but... This is like a bathing suit that I would have to wear like if it was just me and Tyler or like I'm on vacation because they are so freaking thin. I could not believe it. Like, I don't know. Somebody was saying that I was gonna love the meshki quality and nope, I do not. I probably would not buy swimsuit, like swimwear from them again. I will wear these, but I just will not purchase them again. Colors, incredible. Super, super pretty colors, but the fabric is terrible. I got this baby blue one. This one is my favorite one of all of them. It is still very, very, very thin, but the color is stunning. And this one actually has um, like little anchors here, which I thought was super cute and nautical. And I love one pieces. Like I'm a huge one piece fan. Um, if I'm not trying to tan, I love them because they're just super comfortable and this one is cheeky as well it's not a thong just cheeky it has a v in the front v in the back again very very thin in texture and like fabric but the color is stunning and then the last one i got was the one that i was the most disappointed in because i thought it was gray on the camera like on the photos on the website it looked like a perfect cement gray and then i got it and it is actually like i don't know if you'll be able to tell it's all sparkles like this is like there you go, you can kind of see, there. It's all glitter. Like, if I would have known it was glitter, I would not have bought it. It does fit really well, like I do like the way that it fits. I just don't know where I'm going to be wearing this glittery ass one piece. So this is what it looks like here. I thought it was like a gray, like a true cement gray, and it is very much not. Um, I was like, okay, I guess I'll save this for the bachelorette party that I'm not planning because I'm not even engaged. But I will save it so that I can wear it. I have no issues with it. It's a cute cut. It's just not the color that I thought it was. And then this is what the back looks like here. It has like this little situation with like the Meshki logo. That's what it looks like. Again, I will wear all of them. I am just very, very, very disappointed in the quality of the Meshki ones. And then, like I mentioned, I do have two more bathing suits that are on the way. I'll show them to you guys probably like in a vlog or something, but I just didn't want to wait. Sorry, this eyelash is driving me insane. I didn't want to wait to film this video because I've been waiting long enough to film this video, so I wanted to just get it out there so you guys can see. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I will leave all of these bathing suits linked down below for you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.